Brad, 2-2 um, two -two tie. First half, you guys really dominated, but were you know unable to convert. And then second half, four goals get scored. Um, you know the resiliency of your team when you got down two to one to put it put back the uh, equalizer. You had to be pretty uh, happy with that. Sure. I mean, we put ourselves in a tough spot. I think um, you know Akron are a good, good team. Credit to them for uh, coming on the road and earning a tie. Um, you know they're very well coached, very organized. Um, you know so. Uh, we're not disappointed with the time I mean, you'd love three points but um, you know we gained points we didn't lose any mm -hmm. um, so that's a positive and uh, we move forward on to you know the last half of the conference season so five games to go and you know take what we can and move on um, you know just talk about how the in the second half um, it really seemed like things were getting real physical and every play was kind of magnified <laughs> there especially down the stretch um, you know I think it's just a showcase both teams want to win and you know, fatigue, heat, I mean, who thought it was going to be 81 degrees on a, mm -hmm. you know, mid-October day, and um, I don't think either team was malicious or anything mm -hmm. like that, it's just uh, people want to win, and sure. that's what happens, and you have to be able to, to play through that and, and within that. Mm -hmm. um, and finally, talk a little bit about Megan Blake. Um, first two years, she really was a, a defender, and now this year you moved her into the midfield. It seems like it's taken a, a while for her to find her role, but you know, this last couple matches, three matches in a row, she's found the back of the net. Just how important that is for a player off the bench. Well, Megan is a, I mean, she is a, a, a great teammate, she's a great player, very skillful, very smart, and so it's been good for her to, to, to jump into the midfield. She's watched some video, it's helped her, and you know, she has her unique flair, and, and ability to strike a ball and scored some good goals for us and um, you know it's a kind of kid you love to have on your team. Well we will talk to you on Tuesday Brad. Alright thanks Brian.